What's going on guys? It's me, Megacraft Builder, back with another video. So the truth badge was recently updated and the entire way to get it has been changed. And I recently figured this out. I'm one of the only people to know how to get this badge at the moment. So I just decided to show you all how to get it now. So let's get into this. Now before we start, you do need the big slammer to do this uh, right here. You need to make sure you have the big slammer and you need to be at least level 160. So make sure that beforehand. Now just start off by hitting all the corners, kind of similar to um, how you did before in the old method. Oh. Just hitting all four corners. You don't have to go to the middle this time like you did in the other one. Oh, keep in mind you also have to be on computer to do this too. Or at least some kind of mouse and keyboard so you can get the red bubble. So once you get the red bubble, you want to run over here. And the first main step to this after all of the corners is you want to hit this piece of wood here. Now you're going to want to head into the Xeno zone for the next step of getting the truth badge. Once you're here and you have gotten to the end, this next part is a little tricky because you need to get really far up here, but make sure you don't die. Yeah, the anti-cheat will get you, but you need to hit this ball right here. And I'm back at the start. Give me a second. Okay, now I'm back. You need to hit this with Big Slammer somehow. So... It's, it's not easy, I will say this. Um, so let me just cut to where I actually hit this. Alright, there we go. You could see that I hit it there. Um, one thing you need to keep in mind is how big the Big Slammer's hitbox is. So once you do that, you need to make sure you died after. And you want to click the Back to Lawn button. And it looks like there's a minigame. So just give me a second so I can get to the Helic Church. That's the second step. So once you've gone into the Helic Church, you are pretty much on a time crunch here. You have about three or four minutes from what I've seen. So you need to hit all four corners again like we were doing in the main lawn. Make sure to do this as fast as possible, you guys. Um, if your game crashes or you leave, you're going to have to restart this from the start. So, um, yeah, don't let that happen. Once you've done that, you want to stand around this area and in chat say, I wish to know the truth. Spelled exactly like this. Make sure the capitals are correct. And... Over here, you're going to want to go here and press L on this right here. Um, there's a chance it will give you the bubble, a chance it won't. It doesn't matter. Um, just make sure you've pressed L on it. And you should be able to go through this door. Now this here is the final step. You want to hit all four wheels on the car. And then you want to hit this hammer. The final step, you now need to walk into the car. You'll know when you've done it right if you have been teleported to this area. So you want to go to this sign and go in the opposite direction of where it's pointing. After that, you'll find this tree right here. Now what you need to do is climb up it like this. It's a little difficult, so give me a second. Here we go. So now I'm up here. Now what you need to do is say the truth. The same way it's spelled here. Now walk on the rock. And this is the end. Type in slash E wave. As you can see, the ball is right here. 
So what you need to do is just touch it. You'll be teleported to Mobile Lawn and there will be a cutscene. I'm not going to show that because it's really cool and you'll be rewarded the badge.